Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new. So I'm in this cramped location today because I'm in front of my shoe rack again and that's because I'm going to do another shoe collection video for you guys. So today I'm going to be showing you guys my heels. So I'm just going to be starting off with my closed toed heels and then I'm going to be moving into my more sandal like summery heels. So first is this pair. This is the most basic pair of heels that I have. They're from shoe department and they're really old as you can tell if you look on the back behind my ankles. They're really really worn but um, they're still strong. They're still going strong so I still have them and they're just some simple black round toed platform pumps. I just feel like it's like a staple item in any heels wearer's closet. I just feel like you can't go wrong with a basic black pair of heels when it comes to dressing up any type of outfit. And these ones just have like a fake suede material and then like a patent leathery material around the platform. So these pumps are next. I don't know where they're from because they were a gift, but they're pretty similar to the black ones. They're also just round toed platform heels and the best part is they have leopard prints. They're really, really comfortable. I love shoes that have platforms in it because it just makes it so much easier to walk in, but they're still so stylish. So this is another pair of pumps that I have. I've only worn these once and I've had these for like six years. So the reason I got these is because when I finally decided to stop gymnastics, I decided to start dancing and I was looking for an adult class because I was already over 18. So I found one class that was like one of those you just pay as you go $10 a night kind of classes. I think it was like salsa or something. So they just had to get a pair of low heels to wear to the class. So I bought these from Famous Footwear because I was working there at the time. But then I ended up finding a school that actually had an adult competitive team which is actually the studio that I still dance with to this day. So I ended up doing that so I never ended up actually needing these shoes. So I don't wear them very often because the heels are so low and I don't really like low heels. Like they're okay but they're not really my style. Like I feel like you want to be like, oh girl, those are some cute shoes. You know, it's not that kind of cute. It's more like, oh okay, those are cute. Those are, those are cute. I actually forgot I even had these shoes to be honest, but since they're pretty much brand new, I'm just gonna donate them or something because I'm not gonna wear them. So this next pair was also a gift. They're like pumps, but they're peep toes, as you can see right here. And honestly, if I had seen these in the store, I don't think I would have even tried them on to be completely honest with you guys. But wearing them, I actually like them so much more. I just feel like you need like a specific outfit to go with this type of shoe. Like it's not an everyday type of shoe. Like you need the perfect outfit to go with it. That's how I feel. But I really, really like them. The only thing that I don't like is the heels are really skinny and they're very wobbly. So if you ever saw me walking around with these, you would think that I just didn't know how to walk in heels. But the truth is, I'm just really cautious because... I feel them bending with every step that I take and I'm so scared that they're going to snap right underneath me. So for that reason, I don't wear them very often. This next pair is one of my favorites because it is my favorite color. It's hot pink. Well, it's more of a fuchsia, but these I bought when I was working at Famous Footwear. I bought them as an early birthday gift to myself. Um, I remember when I first started working there, they were on the clearance rack for the longest while and I just wanted them, but I didn't buy them. And then one day the price went down even lower and I just stole them off the shelf before they could even put the sticker on them so I can buy them for myself. And yeah, I bought it for myself as an early birthday gift. So these are um, the Fergalicious brand and honestly before I worked at Fans Footwear, I didn't even know she had a brand of shoes. But yeah, they're really cute. They're platform pumps again and they're peep toes and I really like the frill that goes around the toe. And the whole thing is just covered in this shiny satin material. So I just think it's really pretty. And I got compliments on them every single time I wear them. So this next pair I have is from Shoe Department. And I remember that when I got these, I was not even looking for these shoes. But I saw them and they were $4. So I bought them simply because they were $4. It was the only pair they had and it was my size. And they were $4. So why wouldn't I buy them? And I'll be honest with you guys, for years I didn't even wear these because they were way too high for me because I wasn't used to wearing heels like that just yet. So I only recently started wearing them and I'll admit they're a little bit difficult to walk in for me but I don't care. I still tough it out because I love them. They're, these are one of my favorites for sure. For sure. Hmm, which ones do I want to do next? So these are one of my older pairs of shoes. These are also from Famous Footwear. And these, I didn't love them when I first saw them, but they kind of grew on me. And I feel like that's what happens when you work in a retail store or any type of store. Like, you see things that you wouldn't normally want, but after seeing them over and over, and then I got to try them on from time to time, um, it just kind of grew on me, so I ended up buying them. And then I actually got the same ones in silver from my mom. 
I always love the whole caged in design for strappy shoes. The one thing I didn't like about this is how low the platforms were and I like really really tall heels so I always get really high platforms because then I get a taller heel. But um, yeah, these are like a basic shoe. I wear them with a lot of outfits actually. But yeah, they're just some simple black heeled sandals shoes. This is another one of my older pairs of shoes and these are one of my favorites as well because it's covered. Oh, it's not focusing? Really? You're not going to focus? So my camera doesn't like focusing on shiny things. Okay, here we go. So yeah, it's covered in glitter. So right away that calls my name. So these were a gift from my mom, I believe. But I know they're from shoe department because I had told her that I wanted them and then she just bought them for me. I forgot what the occasion was, but she bought them for me. But um, yeah, it's another everyday, well not everyday, but I wear them very, very often. They go with a lot. They're just simple silver shoes. Has rhinestones all over the straps by the toes and then the rest of it is covered in glitter and it has a pretty decent platform also. I'm already almost done. I have a lot less shoes than I thought I did. So I think I need to go shoe shopping. Once this quarantine is over, I'm going shopping, okay? Well, not really. I need to make some money first, but then I am going shopping. So this next pair is one of my newest pairs and it's another sparkly one. Are we focused here? Are we focused? Okay. So yeah, it's another one of these Gladiator caged in designs that I love so much. These don't have a platform at all, but I love them anyway because the heels are really tall. It makes it a little bit uncomfortable, but I deal with it. But I got these from Charlotte Russe when they were closing, so they were on sale. I don't remember how much I paid for them, but I do remember that it was a really good deal. And I love how it has glitter everywhere. I love that it has rhinestones all over the straps. And most of all, I love that they're rose gold. Ugh. I love rose gold. I love them so much. So I think these are my newest pair of heels, honestly. They just might be. And they are my favorite right now. So sparkly. And sadly, we have already reached the end of my collection. This last pair are these yellow shoes. They're um, these strappy sandals. And it has these long tassels that are supposed to like tie up your... Um, your legs. I can't really get them to stay up though whenever I tie them so I just wrap them around my ankles and then I tie them into a bow in the back. But um, I believe they're supposed to go up to like your mid calves if you wear them properly. But I got these from Charlotte Russe a while back. I remember I bought them for a party. I just needed yellow shoes to complete my outfit and I was so glad that I found them. It has like a suede-ish material. These are actually a little too big for me but I actually bought them the day of the party and I didn't try them on the store because I was in a hurry. And when I realized that they were too big, I had already been wearing them outside so I couldn't return them. But it's not too, too big. It's just my feet kind of slide to the front a little bit but that's okay. But I really love them because of how bright and fun the color is like it's the perfect summer color like you can't go wrong with yellow in the summer so that is it for my heels collection I honestly thought I had a few more than that but I feel like it's because a lot of my heels are also like my little booties but I already showed you guys that in my boots collection video so yeah I definitely feel like I need to go shopping because most of those shoes are pretty old so yeah and I love heels so I feel like I need some more you know I need more. So anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed that little haul or collection or whatever you want to call this. I just felt like sharing that with you guys, so I hope you guys liked it. And if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and leave me a comment letting me know that you liked it. And if you haven't already, please go ahead and subscribe to my channel. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll talk to you guys in my next video. Bye!